YouTube channel. I'm in my home office at the moment filming this video. My little fluff ball Coco just wanted to come and say hi on the video. He's my little toy poodle and so yeah I'm at home at the moment filming. He's been enjoying me having me home for a few weeks <laughs> now. He's, is anyone else's pets just like shadowing them, following them from room to room? I don't know if it's just him but he loves it. So in today's video, I'm going to do a little bit of a Kmart haul. So we're all at home trying to self-isolate or whether you're working from home. Did a little bit of an online order of some loungewear. So I thought I'd share it with you. So I've never been a massive Kmart shopper when it comes to clothes and stuff like that. I've definitely bought a few things before from their homewares or their interior stuff. Clothing, I've never really got too much from them before, apart from maybe the odd pyjamas or sportswear stuff. So I wanted to try out some of their loungewear. Really affordable, just I thought some comfy pieces for work from home or lounging around the house and yeah just a little bit of a style update to the loungewear. So we'll jump right into the video with the first piece of the Kmart haul. Definitely looks like we're blending in here. We've got the Sherpa chair, fluffy dog and the Sherpa jumper. So I picked up this one online. I just thought it looked really really cute, cozy, really warm and just fluffy, cuddly just to wear around the house. So this piece is called the Sherpa water zip sweater and I got it in the color Accru. This one cost $20 so super affordable. I just thought it looked really Really cozy, really cute, and I've been loving all this sort of fluffy, oops, fluffy stuff at the moment. So I'd say this one's really warm, really cozy. It's definitely not lined on the inside though, the same as the outside. I don't know if you can see, but it's sort of got a bit of a cotton lining, but it does have pockets. I love, love, love pockets. So big A plus there. It's got a quarter zip at the front. Really cute, really cozy. And I got this one in a size 10. So I'd say I sized up in most of this stuff because I wanted it to be comfortable and oversized to sort of lounge around in. So I would usually be about a size 8, but I've sized up. So I think definitely be oversized and comfy. So I'm definitely loving this whole Sherpa sort of furry, fluffy trend at the moment. I actually just bought a new throw blanket in the same sort of fabric. So that's really funny. I love seeing people layer it out and I think it looks really cheap sort of just thrown over maybe a pair of leggings or bike shorts but also just even tucked into like a nice pair of leather pants with a coat over it so you could easily dress this one up or dress it down so overall I'd say this one's pretty good for the price it's quite affordable and it's really cozy and warm the quality is definitely pretty good too and I think you'd definitely pay I'd probably pay a little bit more for this as well so I think that's good I'll leave the links in the description box if you want to check any of them out make sure that you do so this next one's another sweater jumper and I've been absolutely loving the whole three quarter zip sort of oversized collar vibe and I've seen a few people styling these up on Instagram or even just some vintage ones. I know there's a photo that I absolutely love of Princess Diana wearing a jumper like this. I think she's wearing bike shorts as well. I adore her style. I really love that sort of vintage mixed with a bit of modern sort of fashion. So I really wanted to try these out. So this one is the half zip sweater and I got this one in two colors. So this is the sandstone. It costs $19, so really affordable. And it's a bit hard to tell, I know, online sort of the quality, but let me tell you, I think this would have to be my favorite, probably this style out of everything that I got. Quality is really, really good. I think, so $19, I think I'd easily pay maybe $100 for this one. So you definitely could have picked this up from Zara or somewhere with a much higher price point. So again, like the other one before, I sized up in this one. So I got the size 10, which I think I'm happy with and it's quite oversized. It's a little bit cropped. I wouldn't say it's too cropped, but it definitely sort of sits up, which I quite like. You tuck it into leggings or just over the top of leggings, bike shorts, that kind of stuff. It also would look really cool styled up sort of underneath a puffer jacket, pull the collar up, have your puffer jacket over the top. I'm so, so happy with this one. Really good for the price. The quality, as I said, the quality is really good. It's got nice cuffed sleeves. Really happy with this one and I'm really glad that I picked this one up. So whilst we're on the topic of sort of three quarters in, I picked this one up in black as well. So it's the same as the one before. I don't know which color I like better. I, I don't know, I like them both. I think I'd probably get more wear out of the black one, but the natural one's really nice color of tan as well. The quality's really good, as I said, but also the style. I'd definitely pay way more than $19 for this. Honestly, if someone told me they bought this from, I don't know, somewhere else, I definitely would believe them because it's really good. I went for a size 10 in the black as well, just to get that sort of oversized look. But you could definitely could just go your normal size if you wanted it to fit sort of tailored and fit sort of properly. So I think it'll look really nice sort of style just around the house with leggings and slippers or some cozy bed socks just for lounging. But then when we finally allowed out, 
maybe going for coffee or for breakfast, something like that. I think it'd be nice styled up with a jacket over the top. Even a leather jacket would be cool, I think, with sort of bike shorts or leggings again, with sort of socks, sneakers, or some nice trainers. Model off-duty street style look. So yeah, I think this is probably my favorite out of the whole haul. I can't decide, but probably I'd get the most wear out of this one in the black. Again, really, really good, really good quality, really affordable, A plus. So this next one I know everyone's gonna love. I posted a photo of this one on my Instagram, I think last week, and everyone absolutely loved it. And everyone was really surprised that I just got it from Kmart. So it's sort of like a speckle lounge set. I love, love, love this. Oversized, so you don't need to really size up too much. So this is the size six to eight, and I think we've got the same in the pants. So it's this really cool, sort of got like a flared, little bit of a flared sleeve, it's sort of oversized, really, really nice to just wear around the house. And I love that look at the moment of pairing matching matchy so matching your loungewear set so whether it's like a grey top and a grey bottom or something like this because you can then also pair them with other pieces in your wardrobe so you can get so much more wear out of them and it makes it so much more versatile they're quite thin sort of terry fleece on the inside so they're not too thick the quality is really good it fits really good as well i think it fits really perfect tucked in together looks really good styled up so here's the pants matching to the jumper the leg is quite wide it's actually very very wide so but i really like the style it's really good to Sort of tucked in so I tuck the top in a little bit at the front and leave it baggy at the back I think that looks really cool you could definitely also wear these with something else so you could easily pair these pants with maybe a white t-shirt and a jacket over the top or a blazer if you wanted to sort of get that loungy streetwear look so as I said the sizing is quite similar to just your true size so these are a size 8 so definitely just go your normal size in these also I forgot to mention about the sweaters the top and the matching pants these are $15 each so again really really affordable $30 for the set which is great I mean you'd probably pay $30 if not more than that just for one of them so yeah really really good and really happy with these next up we've got a pair of tracky pants just something that I was really missing in my wardrobe was just like a comfy pair of black pants and I didn't sort of want that whole jogger style for this pair I just wanted sort of something really comfy but not too thick and fleecy so these ones cost $19 which again really affordable really quite good for a pair of track pants I would say out of everything that I got from this haul these would probably be the lowest in the quality. They're still really good and they'll serve me fine. They're really comfy. They're sort of, I don't know if you can tell, they're like a little bit thin. Plus, I absolutely hate when you get lint all over it. So they definitely get a little bit of lint. But other than that, they're really comfy. I do like they've got a cuff at the bottom and the waistband's really thick because that's something that I really like. So I've seen heaps of people styling them up on Instagram or street style bloggers, even with heels blazers, leather jackets, stuff like that. So your trackies, don't forget, they definitely can be versatile. Definitely can get lots more wear out of them if you're sort of daring or you want to try out that sort of street style look. Definitely try styling them up with maybe a bodysuit underneath, a long sleeve one if it's cold, or throwing on a blazer and some heels or trainers, or even like layering a leather jacket over the top. Sort of gives that kind of like edgier look. With the sizing of these as well, I just went my normal size. So these are a size eight, but they're still, they're not tight at all. So they're definitely still got a little bit of room. And I did find, I've worn these once and I did find that they gave a little. So they're definitely comfortable and you'll get lots of wear out of them. Well, someone's enjoying my loungewear video. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just a quick one of me sort of showing you through some of my pieces that I picked up from Kmart. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And from me, Coco, if he wants to wake up, say bye.